Today, the Central Coast Aquarium is a precious community resource with interactive exhibits, outdoor activities, and laboratory lessons for all ages, serving over 23,000 visitors and 4,500 students each year. Since we are the closest aquarium to the Central Coast, we have been able to provide the opportunity for many students like myself to learn about marine science. We are a volunteer-based organization and we could not exist without them. People are really nice here. Everyone's really friendly. I'd say it's just a great place to volunteer because like, you just feel like kind of at home when you do it. Like it's very, you feel very nervous at first because most people don't like talk to the public. And so it definitely takes a couple weeks getting used to, but after you get over that hump about like getting nervous, it really opens you up to like just talking to like anyone and like talking to like just people you don't know or like other aspects of your life where like you go on an interview and then you're put on the spot and then you have to talk to someone and it just makes you like a more confident like talker to people in general as well as people here are just nice. Well, I always knew that I wanted to end up in something marine biology related and my dream has always been to work at an aquarium. I always love being at the touch tanks and having families come in and just their faces light up when you teach them new things and they get to feel the marine animals. And I love when they get excited about marine organisms and I can tell them about my major, marine sciences, and I've had a few that do say that they want to be marine biologists. I'm like, right on. Well, something that I think all the volunteers really enjoy is doing the swell shark encounters. I like it because I think like the look on people's faces when they get to touch a shark, like they're always so amazed at like how it feels. It always feels like so different to them and like new. I like just handling the sharks. I think they're really cool animals and like, you know, it's like not something that I get to do normally. Yeah, preparing the food for the fishes, it's all commercial grade, human grade food that we have to cut up. The shrimp, the squid, and the other fish bits that they get. It's gotta be prepared, you know, to the sizes where the fishes can handle it in sizes and shapes that they can manage. Everybody's got to get fed. You have to go around and make sure they all do. It's just a great opportunity to further yourself in life because it's A, it's a good resume builder, B, you're making an impact with the public and with the community itself, and C, you're helping out the aquarium itself because, you know, this is a nonprofit organization, so they run off of the volunteers. And without us, this place wouldn't be able to function, and thus we wouldn't be able to continue to educate the people of the public. So you truly are making a huge impact when you volunteer here.